Hello and welcome to a brand new video. This is Tennis Manager 2021. I'm Joe if you're new around here. And make sure you click that subscribe button for daily sports and retro gaming content. This uh, is Tennis Manager 2021 as I say and that's uh, coming out today uh, on the Steam store. I will leave a link down below in the description. A big thank you to the developers for giving me um, a, a a code for this an early access code and uh, this is just going to be sort of a first look and well not really a review because i have no idea what i'm doing but uh first impressions and and you know we'll see how it goes and if we really enjoy it and if you guys enjoy it as well then maybe we will do uh some more videos but uh here we are then tennis manager 2021 now uh, the developers did send me a a mod um that you can install that, that has all of the uh real players names on there um i believe it will go on to the workshop eventually as well um but yes uh just a quick look at the settings before we get into things uh you can change all of, of these things save data um match so match simulation so you can watch uh, a lot of the the matches in the in game which is awesome i'm playing in 4k all the ultra settings on uh, and match sound fairly low um for the moment so yes uh, without further ado let's get into the new career i did just uh, check what it looked like um a little bit before see what maybe a match looked like and, and all of that good stuff so let's uh, get into this um our first name will go with captain good speed and uh, I am from the UK, not the United States. So there we go, United Kingdom. Uh, I am 23 years old. I'm a man, age group, young, seniors, veterans. Um, let's have a look at the seniors. Um, goodness me. Oh, you can go into women, which is interesting. Uh, so let's go young. That guy looks all right. Um, who should we go for? Oh, this guy with the tuxedo on. It's got to be him, I think. Yeah, him with the tuxedo. Why not? Um, style, versatile. So there's lots of different things in here. Tactician, very similar to Football Manager in the way that you can um, sort of pick your style and it'll affect your stats. Um let's go for strategist i'm a mathematician so that's probably the best way to go um happy with that ability to provide care one i mean i assume you can't change that can you no okay that's fine right we'll go into next then oh and this is just a, a huge screen that i have no idea what I'm doing. So to select this academy you will join, click on its associated line in the table. So I think we probably want to go with somebody good. Um, I, I did it with a British one before, but what about this F Florida Tennis uh, Academy? Can we actually have a little look at them? Mm, no, you can't, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, I did go with the, the British one. I, I don't really want to go... Uh, yeah, let, let's go with the British one and uh, stick with British tennis players. That's fine by me. And it's sort of a mid-range career if we did want to, to do it. I mean, you can see the details. Ah, here we go. See the details. So you can see Kane Ishikori, Heather Watson's in there, Sebastian Corder, Shintaro uh, Mokazuki, Whitney o o Ozigwe, and Victor Lilov. And then uh, the French Academy... Has got Stefanos uh, Sitsipas, uh, Popperin, Rune, uh, and a few others in there. You've then got the Tierra Victoria Tennis Academy, which has got Casper Rude, uh, Manau, Ila, and so on and so on. Um, British Academy, then you got this one. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think we want to go with the uh, Andy Murray. Um, Cameron Norrie and Eva Shaw. You've got the board director, Tom Heinemann, who I'm assuming is uh, is Tim Henman. We've then got Susie Baker. Surely that's Sue Barker. Uh, and yeah, I'm not sure. 
who, who those two are. An academy that aims to make the most promising and successful British players on the circuit shine in order to dominate the world of tennis. And yeah, John McHero. <laughs> oh, that's what we would have had if we hadn't installed the mod. But um, yeah, let's go for, for this one and see if we can get Andy Murray's career back on track. So here we go. Welcome to the Academy Captain. We're thrilled to welcome you into the Academy. We hope to achieve great things together. Uh, our assistant will guide you through our facilities and explain to you how things work. We will discuss our objectives for the season later. We will uh, introduce you to the public this evening during a press conference. So there's Susie Baker uh, already Sent you a few emails, circuits and rankings. So we've got the MTL, which is the ATP, the uh, WTA, and then the Junior Boys and Junior Girls Tour. Men's Professional Circuit. So you've got Rookie, Pro, Masters and Grand Slam. Number of tournaments counted. Uh, 18 best tournament results over 52 sliding weeks and some mandatory participation rules for the top 50. End of season tournament. Uh, and so on and so on. Very, very cool. Uh, tutorial, the continue button. Okay. Very good. Very good. Right. Uh, let's have a little look at news so you can see all of the um, all of the rankings are, are correct. At least the, the female and, and male ones are. Um, you know, I, I don't really know what the licensing situation is. I assume it's, it's similar to AO Tennis or um cricket 19 those, those sort of ones where you can go in and change them roger federer of course uh we'll try and sign him at some point so this is the overview gives you a summary of the player's information this tab is useful for tracking the player's health indicators okay right that's fine um so he's a legend of course um fame 20 personality don't know uh, I mean, can we scout this guy, evaluate player? Yeah, okay, fair enough. And there you go, straight away we we get uh, we get that. So here's statistics. Grass. I mean, can we go back seasons? Oh, you can. Wow, look at that. Two hundred eighty-three matches played, apparently. Win rate, career. Um, I mean, can we have a look at how many Grand Slams he's won? I think, I think we possibly can. So, yeah, there you go. Got the final there. Hmm. Very, very cool. Awesome. Right, well, we will uh, make sure that we keep an eye on all of this. So, he has won three tournaments this season. Uh, obviously, got the final of Wimbledon I mean it's saying 2020 obviously there wasn't a Wimbledon in 2020 but I guess that's the way they, they've got around it um so here's the circuits so there's the rules tournament categories number of tournaments counted all of that we we knew that already so this is uh the the, the male rankings and you got the the female rankings I wonder where Venus Williams is these days in the rankings uh, surely she's out of the top 100 now. No idea. Yeah, it does. There she is. 78. Well, I mean, goodness me. Goodness me. Um, and you can have a look at the race. So I assume this is sort of the season ranking. Okay, and then tournaments. So this is for, for Andy Murray. Um, so it reminds me a lot of uh, starting orders, actually. Um, now we'll just sort of get me out of the way a little bit to show you the screen. Um, and there's lots and lots of tournaments in there. And of course, lots of things we, we want to consider. Um, I think we possibly want to play in the Qatar Open um, to get ourselves going for the season. So let's register for Andy Murray there. Um yeah, so that, that looks fine to me. Um, for some reason, I can't enter the Australian Open at this point, which is a shame. Um, 
Yeah, so yeah, go for for that. So we'll go for Brisbane, and then yeah, I don't think we want to go for for Adelaide. No, that's that seems fine. So why can't Andy do that? Hmm. Yeah, I'm really not sure. No, I guess that's the Qatar qualifiers. Okay. Fair enough. Right, that's fine by me. Uh, team, so we've got Andy Murray, of course. We've got Cameron Norrie and we've got Eva Shaw. Um, oh, planning. The planning tab lets you see an overview of what your player does week by week. You can find it on the sub menu. This interface helps you to plan your player's schedule between training sessions and tournaments. Okay, so there's lots of stuff we can do here. So that's week 50. Um, okay. And then you, you want to get to, to mastery, basically, don't you? Um, yeah, I can't seem to click on any of these, which is strange. I don't really know what to do with these so you got some reports uh, so you can go into training training calendar so forehand slice so i assume you can you can just do auto select and there you go you can do that and it's it, it looks almost identical to, to fm in that way um i'll get me back by the way so you can see my beautiful face um and you can see lots and lots of different training stuff and I'm sure we will uh, try and try and sort that. Um, yeah, that looks fine to me. Okay, try and get some hardcore mastery ready for the hardcore season. Does that seem like a good thing to be doing, with Andy Murray, as well? Maybe on this Sunday, a little bit of outdoor mastery. Hopefully that will help. We've got game plans. So defensive baseline play, um, big serve attack, on the body play, okay, fair enough. Um, I think just leave a lot of things as as default for now. We've got contracts here. It's just so detailed. There's just so much to have a look at, and this is just so impressive. Um, so, of course, we're going with head. We've got another year on that contract. Okay, and then we've got staff. So assignments interface allows you to allocate your staff to your players. The chosen staff will assist the player during his or her trainings. Okay, can I auto-select this? Um, or, okay. Okay, so there's me. Um, I have no idea. Oops, it's probably not what I want. Um, hands, why not? I mean, hands looks pretty good. If I'm honest with you. Christy looks decent. Canter's okay. Yeah, I, I've no idea. I don't know what the advantage is. I mean, if you guys have played this game before, please do feel free to get in touch and let me know exactly what on earth I should be doing. Because <laughs> um, I feel like I'm messing this up somewhat. But uh, no, that looks fine. That looks fine. We've at least got people assigned. So, presentation of the academy. So, Andy uh, Mare, a national legend, he accompanies us, blah, blah, blah. Cameron Borry, 62th, uh, so 62nd in the MTL. Okay, cool. Um, he's counting on you to pull off one last stunt. He remains our key player, even if you need to plan his retirement in the long run. Okay, cool. Right, let's keep going then. Academy objectives. So keep current players maximum one accepted departure. 
have a balance over uh, zero at the end of the season. Recruit only players with a different status and secondary player have at least 50% of the players with the same nationality as the academy. All right. Um, so academy objectives. There are three types of objectives, sport, financial and image. Each objective has importance and board trust. Okay. So on here, is there anything we can do? They're happy finance presentation that the finances tab gives you an overview of the budgets okay it doesn't look like a lot we can change here earnings okay expenses nice infrastructure okay so this is where we can upgrade our facilities a little bit now we have got 2.5 million in the bank i don't think i want to to splash out too much just yet um and we'll see how it goes Let's get our oh, press conference. Here we go. You've just arrived in London. Have you been here before? <laughs> this is your first time. We've been coming here since I was a kid. There you go. Um, you are joined a prestigious academy. Do you feel you're up to the challenge? I'm very happy that Tim Henman has chose to do this. What is your goal coming here? We hope to maintain the effort. Um, do you think Andy is the best player in the academy? Uh, I'm going to move on to the next question. Awesome, right? Let's keep going then. Let's keep going. I can't believe I've been recording 16 minutes this game. This is going to be an absolute sink of time, isn't it? Um, but there you go. We have assigned some players, which I think is good. Tournament registrations, hardcore season. So we've got Andy Hands. So yeah, I think let staff handle that one. Um for the, the juniors Cameron Norrie okay that's fine by me yeah, why don't we just let the, the staff handle it for now and uh, we'll see how we get on so here we go then um, Arlen's registration Beaver Shaw okay Brisbane International accepted for Norrie and Qatar Open for Andy Murray. Okay, cool. Right, let's keep going then. Weekly team report. He's tired. He's upset. Why is he upset? Um, okay. Not really sure what I can do about that now. Maybe he was upset about certain stuff. No idea. Absolutely no idea. We'll see how he gets on. Tutorial. So there's the help button. So that's the this up here, which which is quite helpful. Academy infrastructure four out of nine. Okay, cool. Right, let's keep going. I just love how s slick this game is. I'm really looking forward to seeing the gameplay. So week fifty two for Andy Murray. I suggest a physics training program. I'll let you have a look and make any changes you like. I don't think we need any. I think that's fine. Okay. So the Auckland Open, he's been accepted for that. Trainer report, everything going up. I mean, she's on good. Uh, team report for him. Weekly report, unread. Here we go. Happy to work with you, coach. Um, do not... So minimum requirements, don't fall below that. Um, he needs to get into a Grand Slam, reach the last one to eight. Okay, that seems pretty good. Fine. Okay, cool. Right, let's move on then. Okay, so we're at the end of week 52. Let's see how our... Guys are doing so. Time to start thinking about tactics. <laughs> Mistakes. Okay. Uh, Andy Murray. Fine, fine. Looking good again. A uh, couple ends open. The Australian Championships. I don't really know why Andy Murray can't enter that. But he can't apparently. 
that's fine. Maybe maybe the Australian Open isn't where we want to be looking for so far. But yeah, he's starting to look a little bit happier now, which is good. In the week 53. And then, of course, we'll have uh, the next one. So we've got, we need to improve laser vision. Movement analysis. Where's movement analysis? Well, it's not going to be on there, is it? It'll be on f physical, I assume. Is it? Or maybe technical? All? <laughs> movement analysis. There it is. All right, let's get that in there. Get some more in there. Why not? And then back. A serve power. Okay, so yeah, maybe just hang on. Movement analysis and then some serve power. So technical powerful serve. There we go. Alright. And then stand there. We we can do that next week. Press conference tomorrow about the start of the season. Okay. The next matches will show if our FS were up to stuff. Uh, put my players in the best conditions for big events. Completing the minimum athletics goals to do everything to help the players progress and reach their potential. And finally, do you plan on bringing more players? Our recruiters always have their eyes on the next up and coming stars. Awesome. Right then. We have got the Qatar Open weekly team report and they're all in top form that is good hopefully that means that we've prepared them well um unread then let's have a look so training report looking good looking good looking good uh newport beach open so that's for andy murray um we've then got eva shaw coming in uh findel hawkins will retire at the end of the season so who's this Oh, he's a coach. Okay. Uh, look forward to working with you. Who's this? Laura Mansfield. Player data. Let's make some money, my friend. Um, with that in mind, I negotiate contracts. I'll also inform you. I'll contact you. Okay. Successful conference. Nice. Right then. Ranking update and release of Junior Circuits 2002 Generation. Okay. Fair enough. Right. Play of the match. So uh Novak's played um where are we? Here we are. So we're playing the world number fifty six. Alejandro uh Davidoc Focoyo, uh who's the fourth seed by the looks of things, so that's not gonna be an easy uh encounter, is it? But we'll try our best. Briefing. Before each match, your analyst provides you with analysis of the opponent gives you advice. Their quality will depend on your analyst level. You can also set your players' intensities and game plan for the start of the match. Lastly, your opponent's stats can help you with your choices. So, he's in medium form. He plays most of the time as an aggressive baseline, a player who likes to control and dictate play. He could switch his game to varied play or even defensive baseline. His strengths are forehand, forehand, reflexes his weaknesses is serve power and the drop shot it's going to be a balanced match but bookmaker has decided andy is the outsider choose a high serve intensity to limit davidoch's okay so a high serve intensity return so i mean this serve isn't very good key points go minimum game plan defensive big serve and attack maybe that's what we go for Why not? Enter the locker room. Talks allow you to manage your player's mental state. Before the match, pay attention to his mental state at the beginning of the conversation and the impact of your words. This can have significant impact on his match start. During the match, you can ask for him to talk, ask to talk to him at the end of each set. Watch the evolution of his mental state to find the right words and boost him if needed. At the end of the match, your player will be impacted by the result. Okay. Right, so he's fearful. Um, uh, 
Don't worry. Maybe don't be overwhelmed. He listened carefully. Okay, here we go then. I, I'm, I have no idea what to expect. We're probably going to get beat 6 love, 6 love, but... Um, <laughs> who knows? Here we go. Go on, Andy. Assume we're the one in pink. Yes, yeah, because we lost the point. That was out. Now, of course, you know, the graphics don't look great. But, you know, that's not what this game is about. Oh, what a shot. That was lovely. Okay. We'll watch this first game, see how he gets on. Oh, that wasn't good. Two break points, and that. Was that not a night ace? Oh dear. Oh, he's not happy. Can I pause it? Yes, I can. Right. Intensity levels. Let's move these down a little bit. Tactical instructions. Okay, that seems fine. Talk. Talk at, the, talk at the end of the set. Yeah, is that what I want? Okay, cool. Right. Let's fast forward a bit. Yeah, easy hold for that guy. And He's looking by far the better player at the moment. Come on, Andy. No, three love down. Whatever's happening isn't working. Hang on. Might have some break points. No, from... Oh, this is this is terrible. Right. Let's go for this one. Um, tactical instructions, right. Let's go for that. Clicking it, edit the tactical. Oh my word. So much stuff. Alright, let's go for that for now. Oh dear. It's too good. Hey, we actually won a game though. Come on, Andy. Oh, he just won it. What a pity. So he's serving to stay in this first set. Come on, Andy. It's meant to be our star player. But no, not looking in good shape at the moment, is he? Well, there you go. Nice ace. So he does hold serve. Out. Come on. Come on. <laughs> this is so intense because you're not in control of it. It's going to be set point now. Yeah, and there you go. So he does win the set, and he mustn't miss his chance. He's many opportunities. Uh, tennis is all about winning these key points, so maybe we put a bit higher intensity on that serve. Maybe not so much on the return. Um... Okay, 
go to the talk. Um, try to put some rhythm back into the match. You can't let him win so much time. Don't rush. Show your emotions. Make him lose his focus. He didn't seem to react. Okay. I mean, oh, I was going to say, hopefully we can hold this first game. And give ourselves a good chance. Oh, come on, that wasn't out. Lovely. Ace down the tee. Come on. Yes! There you go. Fantastic. See how we get some. So break points here. That's a lovely shot though. Ball, second service. Come on. Go on. That's out, yes. Come on. Go on, Andy. Can he hold on? Oof. No. What, what's all of this? 3D analysis, statistics. Lots of stuff, isn't there? Oh dear, he's on advantage now. Shot. Go on, Andy. Come on. No. Another advantage, and there we go. Come on. Awesome. Right. Let's uh, see how we get on. Hey, Andy's broke. Look at this. 4 1 now. Goodness me. He's got some confidence in there. Which is good. Oh dear, he's broke back. That could be the confidence killer. Yeah, needs to hold here. Yes, lovely. So up the intensity on the return game here. Try and get ourselves the second set. Just so engrossed in this. This is awesome. Ball, second service. Fifteen old. Yeah, keep getting it over the net. Two points away here. Oh, still two points away though. Come on now. Yeah, set point. Oh, unlucky. Will he get another chance? Come on. Yeah, another set point. Oh, 
Andy. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, what a pity. What a pity. Yeah, three. Ah, oh, look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? We had two set points and now he's a break up. Two points away from the match. Well, break point. Last chance in this match, you would suggest. No, just again, too long. Match point. Well, he's saved it. Come on. Oh, match point again. Wow. Ooh, I thought that was long. It's okay. Yes, come on. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Tie break now. Wow. Okay, mini breakdown. Oh, that wasn't a good shot. There you go. Three love up now. Need to come back from this. Oh no. Well, we've thrown away this tie break. Oh my word. This would be a very impressive comeback if we manage it. Well, 5 2. Yeah, five three. Come on. Mm, three match points now. Oh, what's out there? No, oh, he's done it. Well, what a pity. What a pity. But that, I tell you what, you know that. That set wasn't too bad. It really wasn't. Um, we didn't do too badly. 45% uh, of the points won. I think where we have to focus our attention on is is maybe more first serves. Definitely winning more of our first serve points. And, uh, you know, maybe, maybe, just maybe. A little bit more. Um in those key moments but um there are lots of things to reflect from he's now anxious okay fair enough um so he's out which is a pity so he's out in the round of 32 i would have expected him to do a little bit better let's uh continue on and see if we can get up to the cameron nori match um so cameron nori Got the round of 16. Okay. So I'm assuming maybe we only watch the, the key players. Eva Shaw, she's just won, but she has just lost there in the semi-final, but was doing recent, reasonably well. Um, 
Okay. I do just want to play one more match here. Um, so play the match. Andy Murray versus Juan Martin Del Potro. I mean, that's going to be a tough one. Enter the locker room. Okay. He's in better form. On high return intensity. Should try and make his opponent run. Okay. So possibly the destabilization play. And let's go for that. Why not? He's fearful. Okay, fair enough. Let's go. Let's get into this. First set. Let's see how he gets on. Four. Second set. Half. Love. Fifteen. Leg. Four. Second set. Come on, Andy. That's out. There you go. Cool. Right. See how he gets on. Well, he leads 1 0. How will he get on against Del Potro's serve? You would imagine Del Potro, big favourite on the serves. He's a big guy, of course. 2 1. Let's see how, how it goes. 3-2, three, 3-3. Three, three. Looks like he'll probably go to a tie break, but he has broke. Hmm, that's a pity, because we were ahead there. Uh, and he is angry. So, yeah, never mind tactical instructions. Yeah, I think... Definitely want to be more attacking. Okay, let's go. See how we get on. Oh, how did we lose that that game? Right then. Well, he's serving to stay in the set. Okay, two points away. Yeah, set point. Oh, Andy. Another set point. Long. Juice. Annoying. Well, he finally wins it, and that's got to be a big one. But again, six five. Seem to be doing better on his serve, but it is going to be another tie break. Come on. No. Well, match point. And there it is. So Juan Martin Del Potro wins. I just don't know what we're meant to be doing here. No idea. <laughs> But that, I think, is where we're going to leave it uh, today, um, you know, for this first part, if you like. But if you did enjoy, give it a big thumbs up. Check it out. It's in early access, so it'll be fairly cheap on the Steam store. I don't know off the top of my head 
uh, how much it will cost you but uh, go and check it out big thank you once again to the developers for the review code i really do appreciate it uh leave a like down below get involved down in the comment section if you'd like to see more let me know i'd certainly be interested in playing some more seeing how we can get on seeing if we can actually win a match but uh, you know we've been fairly close to to two good good opponents so far so we'll see how it goes going forward subscribe for more daily sports and retro gaming content and i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye